Hi guys, so today I'm going to film a video on Get Ready With Me winter skincare routine. I just got out of the shower and I'm going to tone my face. Um, usually I wash my face with um, a clear sonic, but then I still like to tone my face once I get out. So I'm just going to use the cotton rounds from the body shop. And then this is a toner I really like. Um, it's Dickinson's Witch Hazel. And it's all natural and it really is very gentle just to get rid of any residues or um, anything that you didn't wash off when you cleansed in the shower. So I'm just going to wet the cotton pad and then just wipe it around my face. Um, usually when I... I'm in the shower my face is pretty clean but if I was to um, just wash it like with in the sink I would definitely not skip this step but normally um, sometimes when I'm out of the shower I do skip this step if I'm like lazy but you know it's it's good step to tone your face especially with like a gentle toner so <sighs> So I still got like a little bit of um, residue off of my face, so that's good. And once my face is clean and toned, I like to put on some um, toning lotion. This is from uh, the Japanese brand Hara Lapo, and it's very moisturizing, so I just Get a couple drops of that and then rub it in my hands and then pat it onto my face. And then I'm going to move on to eye cream. I've been trying out this Clinique, um, what's it called, Repair Laser Focus and I do like it. So I'm going to put a little bit of that just under my eyes and around the orbital bone and just like um, pat it in. Um, I usually do this more at nighttime, but when I have time in the day, I definitely want to put on some eye cream. But um, it's definitely good for you to wear eye cream at night because when you go to bed, you know, that's when you're... Um, body repairs itself so all the cream gets absorbed and you'll wake up having like brighter under eyes you know or less wrinkles okay and once the eye cream is patted in I go on with my um, oil serum and I have been using this one the um, Ole Hendrickson Pure Youth Activating Oil. Actually, I actually pour some of these in there. Um, I actually ran out of that one, but I just got this one recently. So, and I don't like this bottle because it's not um, a push, like a, it doesn't have a pump. So I just poured this in here and I was running low on this, so... I usually get a couple drops of that and I put it around like problem areas because that's where you want the oil to be working more uh, if you have imperfections but then I pat the rest of the oil around my face I really like vitamin C oil it helps repair the face and heal the imperfections faster and like even out the skin and just helps repair and then once I'm done with that I like to um, I've been trying out this um, Lotus use preserving face cream but if I don't use this or I run out of this I have been using this Clinique's um, moisture surge right now because it's kind of cold and you want to get extra moisture but I have this so I kind of want to use this up and I really have been liking this a lot 
it's um, like a white texture like that. And I feel like it has enough moisture for me. Like I don't feel my face is dry. And um, in terms of it being useful, I don't know. But I do feel that it seems to brighten up my face. And it smells rather cucumber. Like it just had this fresh scent. Like just like almost smells like cucumber. That's the best way for me to describe it. So I make sure I pat the face cream in my face. And then I like to moisturize my lips. And then usually I use this Kiel, um lip balm. It's pretty good in the winter because it's very moisturizing. And I just squirt some out and then like rub it on to my lips and then now my whole face is very hydrated and that's it I might put a little bit of makeup on later on but right now I just want to get everything absorbed and then wait um a little bit before if before I put on makeup or anything else. I wanna wait like five ten minutes to get all this uh, all these products into my face. And that's the quick get ready with me um winter skincare edition. I'm gonna probably do another nail polish haul uh, later on. So. I'll see you guys in a bit, and thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later, and have a good holiday. I know Thanksgiving is coming up next week. So bye, guys.